Good evening. Good night, teacher. Hello, hello. <laughs> We're going to wait a couple of minutes, maybe like two or um, or three minutes before the classes start because I need to get most of your classmates into the class, right? Okay. So that they are not lost when they are getting into. <laughs> Perfect. Meanwhile, let's check how are we doing? Let's see, Monica, how are you? Hi, thank you. And you? Um, great. Thanks for asking. Uh, um, working today is um, this. Bueno, quiero decirles, estaba trabajando desde muy temprano in work. Yes, indeed, my friend. I've been working since <laughs> the day goes down, goes up. Intense day. Intense day. Yeah, yeah, especially because I'm sick and I'm, I'm pretty sick, so it has been really hard. Así que ahí sí me ven que estoy con, con la lengua, con la lengua sí. trabada y me van a disculpar, pero es que he tomado tantos medicamentos. Sí. That right now I'm not feeling myself. No me siento como yo misma. Ay, pero no se le nota, teacher. Siempre dinámica. <laughs> Thank you, Monica. It's because I love my job. <laughs> uh, I see you. I love and job my teacher. Ah, oh, thank you, Monica. That's so cute. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> All right, everyone. So let's check. How are we doing? Let's see, William. How are you? How are you? And I'm. Um, I'm fine, thank you. Uh, my work is very, very stressed. Uh, muy estresante este día. Today is much, much stress. Uh, Today was my stress ah, stress stressful. Okay. Oh, uh, today, practice my Friends, Maria Teresa, uh, the lesson color uh, you said uh, today, jacket, uh, color black. Uh, I told you the, the, the jacket is black, Maria Teresa uh, uh, responded. Oh, uh, smile. Yes, I listened today. Eh, les, eh, la lección de ayer y yo, sí. Excelente, really good. So you were practicing. Sí. Excelente, Monica. That's great. Thank you. Very good. Now let's see. Let's see, William. How are you? I can't hear you. No le escucho. Quizás puede salirse y después volver a entrar. Tal vez ahí le funciona. All right. Meanwhile, let's check. Carla de Hernández, how are you? Why, thank you. I am frustrated. Why, Carlita, why? And the work and complication. Yeah, it's complicated. All right, Carlita, but look at you. It's good to have you in class. Excellent. Although you know you may have problems, it's good to see you in class. Welcome. Okay. Yes. Let me check. Karen, how are you? Hi. Mm. Hello. Yeah. Fine, I'm fine. My day was extraordinary. Are you? 
Wow, Karen, I love that you said that your day was extraordinary. Well, my day was pretty good. Thanks for asking, <laughs> All right? Excellent, let me check. Janita, how are you, Janita? I'm fine, thank you, Miss. Excellent, very good. It's always good to see you. Welcome. Let's see, Carlos Guevara, how are you? I'm fine, thanks. Excellent, very good. Let me see, Angela Rosario, how are you, Angela? Good night. Good evening, how are you? I am tired. <laughs> I know you're tired, but it's good that you are in class. Welcome. Excellent. All right, everyone. So I believe that I have checked most of you. Let me see, Francisco Fernandez, how are you? Hi, Miss. I'm fine. And you? I'm great. Thank you. I'm pretty good. Let me check. Um, now we have Linda Alas and Ruben Pet. All right, everyone. Let me start with the class. I'm going to share my PPT with you. All right. So there you have it. Today is Wednesday, September 8th. 2021, right? Today is eight, right? Yeah. <laughs> we are in whose genes are this, right? Class 11. Let's move on. We have, do you remember? Okay, this is pretty basic for you because yesterday we were practicing with colors and with clothes. So let's check, what do we remember? And let me see. Hmm. Karen, mention at least three vocabulary words related to clothes. Pants, shirt, and... and Dress. Excellent. Very good. Very good. What about you, Janita? Tell me three vocabulary words related to clothes. Big kilo. Per, permitame. In front of, hungry, in front. Related to clothes? In front of, what, sure. Shirt? Uh huh. Shirt? Uh huh. Tie? Tie? Uh huh. Y este. ¿Cómo era el payaso? Um, pretty? Okay, those are about clothes. Let me see. Um, what is this? Uh, what is this that I'm wearing? Black, I uh, know white. Mm, no, but what I'm wearing, lo que, lo que llevo puesto, what is this? Blouse? Yeah, blouse. Let's suppose it's a blouse. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, it's a sweater. All right, thank okay. you. Mira, very good. Let's check, Carlos. Tell me three vocabulary words related to clothes. Shirt, coat, pants. Excellent. Otro, otro, another one. Let's see, Monica. Three vocabulary words related to clothes. T-shirt, shirt, cap, shoes, tie, dress. All right. Excellent, Monica. Very good. Good that you remember. 
And William, I can't hear you. Todavía no le escucho, William. I don't know why. Um, let me see. I'm going to need Ruben Perez. Let's see, Ruben. Mention three vocabulary words related to clothes. Uh, good evening. Sería uh, t-shirt, shoes, uh, sneaker, a cap. Three. Mm -hmm. All right. Excellent. Very really good. Now let's see, Linda Alas. Mention at least three colors that you learned last class. <coughs> White, black, red. Excellent. Bravo. Carla de Hernandez. Three colors that you learned last class. Orange, pink, yellow. Excellent. Very really good. Angela Rosario. Three colors that you remember from last class. Dark blue, yellow, and red. Excellent, very really good. What about you, Janira? Three colors that you remember from last class. Blue, mm -hmm. white. White. Mm. Yellow? Yellow, all right. Mm. Let's see, Emilio, three colors that you remember from last class. Excuse me, teacher. Ajá. Uh -huh. Mencioname de nuevo, teacher, por Mention at least Three colors that you learned last class. Eh, dijo um, yellow. Uh -huh. eh, green. Green. Y black pink y black. All right. Excellent. Thank you, Emilia. What about you, Karen? Three colors that you remember last class, from last class. Blue, black, and red. Excellent, thank you. Now, three adjectives that you remember, Carlos. Voy a revisar los apuntes. Ok. <coughs> Meanwhile, let's have Francisco Fernández. Three adjectives, Francisco, that you remember from last class. Excuse me, repeat, please. Three adjectives that you remember from last class. Mm, ya lo vi que están bien fríos. ¿Qué les pasó? Si tomaron apuntes ayer. Uh, let's see if somebody else can help us. Karen, excellent. Karen, tell me three adjectives, please. He is very good. She is very serious. Um, my prince is beautiful. Excellent, really good. Remember everyone, the adjectives are the one that describes the person. So when you when somebody asks you, tell me the adjective. Thank you, Karen. Very good example. When somebody asks you, hey, tell me three adjectives, you need to tell the adjectives. For example, beautiful, tall, eh, fat, heavy, skinny. Handsome. Handsome, uh-huh. Another one. Pretty, serious. 
Pretty. Pretty. Resterios. Right. Excellent. Very good. Son de los que me recuerdo. Tarde, pero seguro. That's correct, my friend. Very good. At least you remember. What about you, Janira? Tell me three adjectives. Eh, esquí, esquí, ¿verdad? Mm, esquí. <laughs> I don't remember. ¿Cómo se escribe? No me acuerdo. Es que estaba tapada ahí con un poquito de letra. Pero le voy a decir otra. Pretty, serious, beautiful. Beautiful, excellent. Beautiful. Very good, Janina, <laughs> excellent. Uh, now, let's see if Francisco remembers now the adjectives. Aha, uh -huh, Francisco. Seria all uh, my role um, round. All right, excellent, very good, thank you. What about Carla de Hernandez? Tell me three adjectives that you remember. Good, great, handsome. Excellent, very good. Emilio, do you remember adjectives? No, te, después le diré ¿sí? porque no lo entiendo todavía. ¿sí? Ok, mire, los adjectives los vimos. A... Estuvo en la clase de ayer, ¿verdad, Emilio? No estuve. No estuvo, pero vio la clase no en YouTube. No, no estuve. Sí, la, 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 tuve una pequeña pasada, no. pero sí, no, no, no. Hmm, ok, Emilio. Try to check this out. No quiero que se quede atrás. Ok. So try to look for that information. Sí, and all right, everyone. Sí, so sí. Don't forget everyone that adjectives describe persons or people or objects, right? For example, my sister is beautiful. My sister is short. Um, my dog is a small. Adjectives are pretty useful, believe me. So I want you to remember to recall adjectives. You have plenty of vocabulary in here and I'm pretty sure that if you study the vocabulary, everything will be easier for you, right? Now let's move on. We have possessives. We have adjectives, pronouns, and names. Let's see, Carla de Hernandez, tell me the adjective, one adjective, and Carlos Guevara, you are going to tell me one pronoun. For example, Carla, you will say my, and Carlos will say mine. Okay. My. My. Your. Yours. These are his socks. His. Her. This yeah. sock are here, hers. Our. Ours. They. Theirs. Bravo. Excellent. Thank you. Let's go with Monica. One adjective, Janira, the pronoun. Action. Adjective, my. Mine. Mine. Uh -huh. Your. 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 These are, these are his sock. Is. Hair. These socks are hers. Or. Ours. Their. Theirs. Excellent. Thank you very much, ladies. Angela Rosario, you are adjectives. Linda Alas, you are pronouns, action. 
No, William, I can't hear you. Todavía no le escucho, William. William, no le, no le, bueno, no me va a responder, pero cuando usted entra, usualmente le da un anuncio de que puede escuchar el audio, creo que dice. Entonces, dele clic en el botoncito azul donde le dice que sí, sí necesita escuchar el audio y le va a pedir que lo haga ya sea con el internet de casa o, o con, los, con los datos que ande. Right? Pero para eso tiene que salirse y entrar, creo yo, de nuevo. Teacher. Ajá, Francisco. Aparece un recuadro y aparece entrar sin video o con video. Y Ajá. luego de eso le sale como una lucecita verde y le aparece wifi o datos, algo así. Eso, tiene eso. que apretar ahí en las letritas y ya sale normal. Uh -huh. Exactly. Thank you, Francisco. Very good. Ok, let's continue with Linda Alas and... Angela, action. My, mine, your, yours, his, his, her, hers, our, ours, their, theirs. Excellent. Thank you very much. Karen, Karen, you are the adjectives and I will have, and I will have Francisco Fernandez. You are the pronouns. Action. My. My. Your. You. These are my shops. Yes. Hair. Herbs. Or, or, there. Late. All right, thank you. Don't forget the pronunciation is our, our, right? Our. And there you have it. Pretty good, excellent. I'm proud of you. You did a great pronunciation. Let's go with names. We have Pat's Bloss, Julie's Jeans. Red's t-shirt, okay? These are also adjectives, possessive adjectives. Aquí ustedes muestran posesión al agregarle la S al nombre, right? Bad's blouse, Julie's jeans, Red's t-shirt, right? And then we have some questions. Whose blouse is this? It's Pat's, right? Instead of saying, This is the blouse of Pats because that's not even possible in, to communicate. We are going to say it's Pats. Basic as that. Whose jeans are this? They are Julie's. They are Julie's, right? Now, let's keep an eye on this information and let's move forward. We have subject pronouns, adjective and pronouns. Let's see. I'm going to start with Monica. Monica, tell me the subject pronouns, the adjective and the pronouns. But I want you to do, for example, I, subject pronoun, adjective, my, pronouns, mine, right? Subject pronouns, I, adjective, my, pronouns, my, subject pronouns, you, adjective, your, pronouns, yours, subject, he, adjective, his, pronouns, his, she, her, hers, it, its, its. We, or, ours, they, their, theirs. All right, thank you, Monica. Excellent. Repeat after me, Monica. Our. 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 Excellent. Very good. Let's go with Alejandro. First, subject pronouns, then adjectives, and then pronouns. 
Uh, I am you, he, she, it, we, they. Okay, okay, Alejandro, vamos uno y uno. Subject ah, okay, pronoun yeah. I, adjective my, pronouns my. Ah, okay, okay, okay. I, my, uh, mine, mine, mine. Your, you, your, yours. He, his, his. She, her, hers. It, it's, it's. We, our, ours. They, their, theirs. Okay, repeat after me, Alejandro. Their, their, theirs. Dayers. Excellent. Very good, my friend. Let's go with Karen. Let's see, Karen. Karen. <laughs> I, my, my, mini, mini, mine, mine. Se le apagó el micrófono, Karen. You, you, yours. He, it, is. She, Air, airs, it, 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 we, our, ours, they, their, they. Thank you, Karen. Repeat after me, Karen, please, All right? Let's pay attention. His, 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 he, his. Exacto. Si usted okay. me dice is aquí, me está diciendo el verbo. Por eso tiene que pronunciar is. Is. Okay. okay. Thank you. Very good. There you have it. Carlos Guevara. I, my, mine, you, your, yours. He, his, his, she, her, hers, it, its, its, we, our, ours, they, their, theirs. Excellent, thank you, very good. Let's go with Linda Alas, please. Subject pronouns, adjective, and part. I, my, mine. You, your, yours. He, his, his. She, her, hers. It, its, its. We, our, ours. They, they, theirs. Excellent. Thank you. Janira, your turn. I, my, mine, mine, you, you, your, your, he, his, his, she, her, hers, it, its, its, it, our, our, they, 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 they. Continue, Yanir. Right, finished. Excellent. Hoy sí, yo creo que ya se le escucha a William. Let's check. Check, check. Hello. 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 Yeah, we can hear you. Okay. Good night. Good evening. Welcome. Good evening.
All right, let's check. Thank you, Janina, for your participation. That was wonderful. Let me see, Carla Hernandez, please. Hi, my mink. You, your, yours. He, his, his. She, her, hers. It, its, its. We, our, ours. They, they, they their, theirs. Repeat after me, Carla. Our. Ours. Uh -huh. Ours. Right? Our. Thank you. Let's go with Emilio. Let's see, Emilio. Okay. My, my, you, you, yours. He, his, his, she, hers, hers, if, ifs, ifs, we, our, ours, they, theirs, theirs. All right, thank you. All right, let's go with Ruben Perez, please. Subject pronouns, adjective and pronouns. Everyone, and I want you to listen to this. Lo estamos practicando y todos tienen que estar prestando atención a lo que sus compañeros dicen, ¿ok? Porque la, hay una diferencia bien variada en cada una de estas tres cosas. Y si se me confunden en una pronunciación, pueden dar a entender otra cosa. Por eso es que estamos practicando esto, right? Let's go, Rubén. Subject pronoun. I, my, mine. You, your, yours. He, his, his. She, her, hers. It, 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 we, our, our, they, theirs, and theirs. Excellent. Thank you. Very good. All right, everyone. Now let's check this one. <coughs> Alejandro, please tell me this information. We use? We use adjective when the when the object is at the end of the sentence sentence repeat the sentence the sentence mm -hmm. excellent thank you alejandro all right everyone if you don't have this information copy this on your notebook right it's telling you we use possessive adjectives when the object is at the end, al final, at the end of the sentence. Let me see, Janira, read example number one, please. They say, are you, oops. Okay, repeat after me, Janira, this. This, this, are you, oops. Your cups. Cups. Excellent, very good. My object is at the end. Thank you, Janina. Let's see, number two, uh, Angela Rosario. This is your com computer. 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 Mm -hmm. Excellent, very good. Thank you. And the last one. Linda Alas, number three, please. <coughs> Those are his documents. Excellent, thank you. Those are his documents, very good. Excellent. Now, notice, my dear students, please keep an eye on this. Notice, cups, computer, and documents, those are going to be my objects and they are at the end. Karen, you are raising your hand. Do you want to say something? Yes, uh, uh, a question uh -huh. is number two, the sentence. Uh, this, this is your, 
Y ahí, ahí no iría are. No. This is your computer. Ah, es, ah, ok. Ok, sí, tenía confusión por, con el is your, porque como antes, your. Ajá. Para el afirmativo utiliza you are. Ah, ajá, ajá. Pero okay, recuerden okay. que con estos demonstratives, estos son los demonstratives. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Aquí yes. varía un poco la situación. Utilizamos this is your computer. Nosotros estamos hablando okay. de this. Okay. Si yo tuviera, okay. por eso les puse los dos examples. Y muchas gracias por su pregunta, Karen. Eso me muestra interés. This are your cups. Ahí ya estoy hablando de dos o más. Tazas, cups, right? Excellent. Remember this, this. Okay, thank you. This with is. You're welcome, my friend. All right, no more questions about this, my dear students? No? Hello, Miss. Hello, William. Hello. How are you? I'm good, <laughs> thanks. How about you? How are you? Thank you, Miss. Gracias por la espera. Don't worry, don't worry, my friend. Tuve bastantes problemas, pero ya estamos, bueno, desde el principio estamos presentes, pero <risa> ahorita sí ya creo que se escucha ya bien el audio. Ahí va a disculpar. Bueno, no, participar. no se preocupe. It's Gracias, okay. Miss. Thank you. All right, everyone. If you don't have, si no tienen esta información en su cuaderno y desean tenerla, copienla. All right. Es importante que sepan que los possessive adjectives are going to be, we use possessive adjectives when the object is at the end of the sentence. These are my possessive adjectives. Your, your, his. Okay. Let's go with the next one. Monica, please read this information. We use? We use possessive pronouns wherever the object is at the beginning of the sentence or not mentioned at all. Excellent, thank you. Now let's check this one. William, tell me the guiding examples, please. These cups are yours. This computer is yours. These documents are his. Excellent, very good. There you have it. Now it's telling me that my objects are in the middle and my possessive pronouns are at the end. Aquí varía, el possessive pronoun va a ir al final, goes at the end, okay? I want you to keep this in mind, everyone, because now you're going to practice, okay? So copy this on your notebook if you don't have it. I have a question. Excellent, Linda, tell me. In example number three, why is these documents are his? Excellent, very good. A esto se refiere? Al yes. Yes, right. because it's plural. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, Linda, excellent, very good. All right, if you already have this on your notebook, let's move on. Practice time. Right now you have the content, you know how to work with it. Let's check how can we write some sentences. Instructions, 
please, Alejandro, tell me the instructions. Number one, work individually. Two, uh, create two sentence, sentences using possessive adjective. Number three, then create two sentences using possessive pronouns. Excellent, thank you. <clears throat> All right, you know how to use possessive adjectives, let's work with them. And then you're going to create two sentences using possessive pronouns. Let's work, please. You're going to have a lot of time, so don't worry. You finished, Monica? Yes, finish. Okay, tell me your examples of possessive adjectives. Yes, my sentence is use a possession adjective. Example, one, this is your case. Two, these are your book. Your books. Six, your books. Uh -huh. And now with possessive pronouns. This, this, this case are yours. This case are yours. Uh -huh. These books are his. Excellent, Monica. Very good job. Thank you. Karen, excellent, Karen. Tell me your examples. Uh, se sentence, sentences, uh, adjective. This, this, these are, these are our apples. Uh -huh. it, the, he, this is my car. Uh, this, this, the sentence, Pronouns. Pronouns. Uh -huh. These apples are ours. This, this car is mine. Excellent. Bravo, Karen. Bravo. Very good. Thank you.
Somebody else? Let me see, I'm going to choose. What about Francisco Fernandez? Tell me your two sentences using possessive adjectives. No, not ready yet. Let's see, Carlos Guevara, tell me your two sentences using possessive adjectives. Your hair is mine. Her color is blue. Possessive adjectives? Your hair is mine, okay? Uh -huh. Okay. This is our bed. There are our, our socks. All right, excellent, very good. Those are with possessive pronouns. Ajá, uh -huh, Carla, yes. A ver, tengo una pregunta. ¿Tienen alguna duda entre los pronouns y los possessive adjectives? Because That's why I wrote the same examples. Por eso les puse los mismos ejemplos en ambos, pero solamente les puse cómo cambiaban en cada uno. Teacher, yo siempre... Perdón. Uh -huh. eh, teacher, yo sí mantengo siempre la duda este, porque no he comprendido bien esto. No sé si... Después le puedo escribir ahí porque ahorita le voy a absorber tiempo. Mm, no, dígame mejor ahorita porque quiero que quede bien claro que ambos son diferentes. These three are different. Eh, por eso los puse que los pronunciaran sí. para que vieran la diferencia entre cada uno. Pero, sí. ¿qué siente usted, Emilio? ¿Qué es el, 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 lo que le cuesta? Sí, me cuesta comprender este... Ahorita lo que es el, el posesivo está el, sí, es verdad. Uh -huh. El posesivo y el, y el, y el que es este. El pronoun. El, 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 ajá, correcto. Bye. Entonces, este, no, no, todavía no he comprendido, teacher. Ok, dice, we use possessive adjectives when the object is at the end. Al estar el objeto de mi oración o el complemento al final, Voy a utilizar mi possessive adjective antes. A ver, Emilio, ¿qué es esto? ¿Des? ¿Qué es? Gramaticalmente, ¿qué es? Porque ya lo vimos. Sí. Pero todavía no, no le entiendo perfectamente, teacher. Algunas que otras palabras este, no me he ubicado todavía. Veamos, William, ¿qué es des? This. ¿Qué es? Gramaticalmente hablando, ¿qué es? This. Es el... In a question. Es un demonstrative. Okay. These are demonstratives. Eso es lo que yo no. quiero. Que hagamos el análisis de esto, porque no quiero que se confundan. Hemos utilizado It's los wrong. demonstratives aquí para hacer más fácil un poco el, el hecho del uso de los adjetivos posesivos, right? This, a ver, Emilio, ¿qué es are? No quiero la traducción, quiero saber qué es are. Are es este, es nada más este, es un, es un pos, o sea, es mío, es personal, ¿sí? Are es el verbo to be, eso, ya ve, eso es lo que yo necesito, que reconozcan qué es cada cosa para que se les facilite. These are demonstratives. Are is verb to be. Your is the possessive adjective. ¿Ok? Así está dividido. This... ¿Hemos visto eso? Ajá. 
Entonces me dijo que es este. Demonstrativo. Es, de, 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 demonstrativo. Demonstrativo. El demonstrativo, entonces. Uh -huh. Y el y el R. It's my verb to be. Verbo to be. <coughs> y el your que es. Yours. No, no yours. Your. 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 ¿Qué significa? No, no quiere el significado. ¿Qué es? Veamos qué arran qué es. Por ejemplo, lo podemos poner así como usted nos pone en las oraciones. Eh, eh, demonstrative plus. Eh, Verb to be plus adjective plus complement. Excellent, really good, Karen. Sí, pero en este caso no se olviden que your es possessive adjective. Miren la tabla, esta tabla quiero, esta tabla sí se la voy a pedir memorizada a todos. Ok. Your es el possessive adjective. Ok, your. O sea, teacher, de que. Eh... Si mi oración, según yo, la he hecho eh, para pronoms y no he usado nada de lo que tiene la, tab la tabla, no es un pronoms. Es que para que sea de pronouns tiene que tener estos. Mine, yours, his, hers. Es que estos son los pronouns. Ah, ok, sí, porque igual tenía, hasta hoy que el compañero preguntó ahí, entonces yo los estaba haciendo. Y me doy cuenta que en teoría no, no, no usé ninguno de esos, de, de los pronoms. Ok, very good. Alejandro, gracias por decirme eso. Mir, eh, por eso les pongo guiding examples. Por medio de las oraciones nos podemos ir fijando en la colocación de la gramática. Ok. Eh, for example, aquí... La información dice, whenever the object is at the beginning of the sentence or not mentioned at all. Pero dice, we use possessive pronouns whenever the object is at the beginning of the sentence or not mentioned at all. Los objects serían cop, computer, and documents. Right? Esos son mis objetos. Objects. La información dice que a veces no se van a mencionar. Por ejemplo, yo puedo decir, um, these are your cops. These are yours. Y ya no menciono el objeto. Solo digo, these are yours. Pero si sí necesito mi pronoun al final. ¿Ok? El pronoun no me puede faltar porque si no, no va a ser, no van a ser sentences con pronouns. ¿Ok? Let's see if somebody else have sentences. Aníbal. Do you have your sentences? Hi, good evening. Hi, good evening, uh, Aníbal. Lo siento, estoy, yo, sí estoy escuchando, pero estoy trabajando en unas cosas de mi trabajo, pero... Uh, ok. For okay. possessive adjectives. Mm -hmm. Uh, for example, this is your mirror, uh, this is your, your, your jacket, or these are your daughters. All right, excellent. For possessive pronouns, uh -huh. is, this mirror is yours, uh -huh. these daughters are, are mine. Uh -huh. And these clothes are for you, are, are yours. <laughs> pretty good. Don't worry, it's okay. Let's see, Alejandro, what you got. Okay, teacher, voy a decírselas y usted me dice si están bien. Yeah. Eh, sería eh, possessive adjective. Eh, my car is back. My sister for you, her money. Eh, my, eh, 
possessive pronouns. Number one, this, wa this watch is mine. Uh -huh. The dog is yours. It's yours. Yours. The dog is yours. Yeah, Alejandro. Excellent. Very good. <laughs> they are correct. Sí. La verdad que sí, tenía esa duda. Igual todavía como que me va a costar, ¿va? pero eh, creo que sirvió la pregunta del compañero para que nos, nos despejáramos todos. Yes, everyone. Yo siempre les voy a decir, no se queden con las dudas. Ahora bien, también hay algo. Porque si son temas que vimos desde la primera clase y me los van a preguntar en la clase número, déjenme, déjenme en la número 11, ya ahí ya es preocupante, right Ahí sí es de preocuparse porque... Ustedes tienen las grabaciones y pueden chequearlas y plus tienen la oportunidad de ingresar a las clases. Eso es una. Pero siempre pueden preguntarme cualquier duda que tengan. Si yo en el momento, yo se lo dije desde la primera clase, si yo en el momento por algún motivo me blanqueo y no sé la respuesta de algo o se me ha olvidado, tengan por seguro que yo se las voy a dar la respuesta en la siguiente clase. Pero no quiero que se queden con dudas porque este es contenido puro y vivo para empezar a adquirir el lenguaje, right? Let's see, Linda Alas. Eh, fíjese que yo me estaba metiendo en la plataforma, pero los videos que ponen ahí a veces son bien cortos y no está toda la información que vemos acá en la clase. Pues no sé si no he visto, el, o, o sea, no sé si me he metido en, en la parte incorrecta, pues, pero si nos pudiera mandar esta información para tenerla, pues, y, y, y revisar y estar un poco más preparado antes de la clase. Porque igual ayer yo me metía de los temas, ¿verdad? En la plataforma uh -huh. para ver qué era lo que íbamos a ver y medio prepararme uh -huh. para no estar aquí así como bien así en la, en la nube. Yes. Pero, lo que sucede es que antes de explicarle el tema no les puedo enviar mi, mi planificación básicamente, que uh -huh. es la PPT. Uh -huh. y se las puedo enviar después de la clase, pero igual lo que yo quiero es que ustedes, si yo se las envío y ustedes tienen... Ah, mi teléfono va a estar en las pictures o todo. Mentira, no lo vamos a estudiar. Entonces, por eso yo siempre les digo, escríbanlo en su cuaderno, take notes. Ah, right? pero es que a veces, no, bueno, a veces cuando se dice escríbanlo, es bien poco tiempo, ¿verdad? Entonces, al menos yo no escribo tan rápido. Por eso le decía, pero no sé. No, linda, pero sí puedo enviar después la... la... La PPT, la porque sí me interesa que es, es lo que usted mencionaba, si sí, la plataforma brinda excelentes ejemplos y los vídeos, pero yo siempre trato de rebuscarme un poquito más para que ustedes tengan un expandan uh -huh. conocimiento. Sí, sí. sí, sí. Right. Eh, let, let's go with Francisco y después with Janira, ¿ok? Janira? Solo que Francisco tenía la mano arriba. Let's see. Ok, ok. Eh, va a disculpar, mis, pero estaba haciendo la oración y tal vez están buenas. Okay. My house is nearby. Um, adjectives. Um, second, um, are these your friends? <coughs> y en las otras. Serían, for example, is this vehicle yours? <clears throat> Second, those shoes are mine. Those shoes are mine. Yes. Excellent, very good. Sí, y me gusta que mencionó el object. Excellent. It's okay, Francis. Very good. Ajá, Yanira. Now it's your turn. Yeah, una pregunta. Miss, en la plataforma los videos de las clases no son la clase que usted nos da, sino que, o no sé si yo no lo he encontrado, pero salen otras clases, no he visto la suya. ¿Serían otras clases las que están subidas o está en la suya exactamente? No, lo que ustedes van a encontrar en la plataforma es el cuerpo básicamente del contenido, ¿ok? Ah, es ya. cuando ellos explican, les da una breve explicación. Es bien breve porque solo dura como dos minutos o tres, creo, cada, cada vídeo. Por eso ah, es que bueno. yo les traigo más guiding examples o los pongo a trabajar en, en sentences o cosas así. Ah, bueno. Bueno. Pero la clase, la grabación la van a encontrar en YouTube. 
¿ok? A ustedes les mandaron un correo con la plataforma, con ajá, cómo ingresar a la plataforma y también cómo ingresar específicamente al listado de YouTube. Y ahí lo pueden encontrar y pueden repasar. Yo estoy segura que eso les va a ayudar. Bueno, mi gracias. You're welcome. All right, everyone. Time's up. We are just in time, all right? Uh, let me see. Tomorrow we're going to continue with this topic because I'm seeing that this is pretty uh, difficult right now. So we're going to stop in here, relax, and be ready for tomorrow's class. And that's pretty much it. See you tomorrow. Have a great night. Bye. Okay, goodbye. Bye. Good night. Bye. Goodbye, thanks.